morning guys um today's saturday the 2nd of march 2024 we are now in march it's my birthday month um, i don't know how i feel about that i didn't want to celebrate my birthday last year but this year i said i would i'll do something i don't know but yeah it is nine minutes past nine ten minutes past nine now in the morning i've just been cleaning for like the past hour to hour and a half i wanted to like thoroughly clean the room the bathroom all of that so now i need to work out take a shower and then i can finish doing my hair i want to show you guys this it's a bathroom mat for our bathroom it's really really soft like super super soft and i love the little print it's simple but it's cute i hope it looks nice in the bathroom um this is from bola you know it's a decent size um i think might just get another for i think we might just get another one for the shower and then put this one by the bathtub i'm not sure but yeah it's really cute simple i am exhausted guys if you can't tell i'm exhausted but i need to work out also george is in my rondera with his friend for the weekend so i didn't have george here last night so jesse slept in my room we had like a huge sleepover it was so fun i've missed it because i used to share a room with jesse from the time he was born up until i got married so it was just cute, but yeah. <laughs> you ever have like those days when the kids are making noise but like when you're just not having a good day and then everything just seems to be like against you on that particular day because today is that day for me and i don't get it because i woke up in such a good mood today i worked out i i haven't read my bible actually maybe that's why because i said i was gonna read my bible but yeah i woke up i prayed i worked out i cleaned and now it's like i'm gonna sit down and do my hair but i've just spilled juice all over this part of the bed so i just have to take off all this bedding and put all your bedding it's just frustrating honestly yeah but anyway, it is what it is. Um, yeah. And the weather is just iffy. Today was sunny. It's been like really like cold and overcast the past couple of days. Today was sunny in the morning. Now it's going overcast. So I don't even know. In the time since like the last time I saw you guys, I took a shower and then I ran down to Chizzy shops because I wanted to get these journals by the pharmacy. And we've just gotten back. So... This is what they look like. It's three journals. The set of three. Um, well, it says notebooks, but I'm going to use them. Let me open them first, and then I'll tell you guys what I want to do with them. Oh, I like the material. Yeah. So this is what they look like, and it's a set of three. And how do you open this? You just slide it off. If you can hear the puppies, they're like barking like wild outside. I don't know. So the first one is in this print, and it says, um, Be Still, which is song... 46 verse 10 and the inside just looks like this it's got the same print and then just basic lines the second one says um be strong and it's joshua 1 verse 9 and it's got this little print and then the inside has oh the inside has the same print as the first one i thought it was gonna have like something like this but i guess and then the last one says, be joyful, and it's 1 Thessalonians 5, verse 16. Yeah. 
and this is the print and again the inside is exactly the same so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use all three of these right I haven't decided which one I'll use for what but I just know that I'm gonna use one as my journal like my prayer journal so I think I'll use be still be still will be my prayer journal I think yeah I think be still will be my prayer journal and then between be joyful and be strong one will be like my content planning content planner little notebook and then the other one will be my just like my little jotter so if i need to jot down notes from a meeting with a client and stuff like that this is not even the half of my stationery but that's what i'm finding because people just dig into my things but i have all of these highlighters for when I'll be doing like my Bible study and stuff. Oop! Why is my eyeliner in there? This is a glue stick for Jesse school stuff. And then I've got these highlighters. So I've got two types. Yellow, green, orange, and pink. And then the second type, I've got five. So yellow, purple, orange, blue, and green. This is Jesse's rubber. I don't know why it's also in there, but he likes to just put his things where my things are. And then this is where my pens are supposed to be, but this is not even half of my pens. And all of my fun pens are missing. And I know someone took them and it's getting on my nerves, but I'm, they might just be in George's bag, so I'll check there. Sticky notes, obviously, in pink and like this peachish color. I like using these when I'm doing like my Bible study. So when I'm journaling and doing like my prayer journaling, I'll use these. Um, I bought these for prayer journaling as well, but I actually realized I don't like them. They look focused. Too, like, childlike. Um, so I think I'm going to give these to my niece. The channel I know there's a mess around me but there's a very valid explanation for what's going on but it is Saturday the 30th of March and it is five minutes past three in the afternoon at five o'clock I need to get ready because we have Easter vigil mass at six so all of this mess needs to be cleaned up by five it's not really five actually because my aunt is coming to visit me because she hasn't seen me since I was in hospital she's coming to visit me in about 30 minutes time Anyway, um, I realized today in the morning, right, I wanted to edit a vlog tonight, right? So I was trying to like get all the footage, compile everything. Then I discovered I somehow lost all of the footage from that vlog. But I really remember putting it in my laptop and then deleting it from my memory card once it was in my laptop. Or I just thought I put it in my laptop and then I actually didn't. I don't know, but I just don't have that footage anymore. I just have like a bit of it from the very beginning of the week. But, yeah. But basically, it was finished from the last two weeks, actually. But basically, what happened in those two weeks was I turned 27, period. Um, so, like, the week leading up to my birthday, because my birthday was on a Monday, right? So, the week leading up to my birthday, um, George um, got me booked for a deep tissue, full body deep tissue massage at Nagomi Spa, which will only be open on the 1st of April, which is Monday. But, you know, when your husband does the branding, you get, like, special perks and stuff. So, you know, I got to go in before other people did. It was really nice. I needed that so much. She did, like, everything, like, when she cracks your neck. And she was literally, like, on me. Like, it was so painful, I won't lie. But after, my body felt so new. Like, when they say deep tissue massage, they mean deep. Like, it is painful. It is not one of those cute little massages that you're going to be Instagramming about. But trust me, the effects of it are amazing because after, I'm just, yeah. Oh, he also got me a Stanley. Let me show you. You know, because like I'm now in my Stanley Cup era. 
or whatever. Ah! I'm gonna fall. This is totally such an unpleasant But yeah. He got me a Stanley. This is our baby. You know, Stan Stan. It's like an off white creamy color. It's very, very cute. I love it. And also, I just like, anytime I see it, I'm like, I wanna drink some water. <coughs> That's it. <laughs> but anyway. And he also got me these um, shoes. They're from Mr. Price. And they are like little platform, like black shoes very, very cute and then he also got me the same shoe but like in a flip-flop style and it's more of a champagne -y type um like beigey color so cute so yeah and then on my actual birthday i got birthday cake it was a huge birthday cake it was so pretty so yummy full chocolate and then on the saturday after my birthday we went for dinner we went for dinner at um, three monkeys. It was four couples, so eight of us, like us and like three of our couple friends. It was really cute, so wholesome. Like I genuinely feel like God is putting people in my life who I need, like just good friends, who are just like good vibes, good energy, no pressure, no, well like positive pressure maybe, let's say it that way. But yeah, I felt really good. It was such a good birthday. Um, we didn't do anything too hectic, but I genuinely loved it, you know? So the reason why I have not been able to upload anything recently is because we decided last minute that we were going to go to Botswana. Originally we weren't, it was just going to be the kids. And then we were like, you know what, we all want to go. The problem with that is, I obviously have clients that I've signed on on a month to month basis. And I will be gone for the entire month of April. And I can't then stop work just because I want to go and have fun. It doesn't make sense because me are going to school fees with you. So, I literally had to film all of my clients videos. For the month of April in the space of one week. The usual, we've got chips, we've got the wasabi glaze, we've got fruit and chutney, like Miss, Mrs. HS Paul Simbas, and then we've got the beef, um, smoked beef Simbas as well. We've got apples, I'm not really an apple person, but I guess other people are. So everything you're seeing here is literally in the other pack. The other pack probably just has a little bit more because there's more people in that pack. And then George and I got one of these each. So I got George this. We haven't tried the iced tea from Simple before, but we typically do like iced tea. So I figured we would like it. So George, I got George the lemon flavored Roy Boss iced tea. And then I got myself the berry flavored honey bush iced tea though knowing George is probably going to want mine just because I said it's mine so and then my sister and my niece um, there's three of these simple drinks as well and it's just the orange juice and it's 100% um, fruit juice so there's three two are for my sister one is for my niece because my niece also has a bunch of other drinks so just got four of these we bought like two six packs and then we took four out for my niece and then there's eight in the other plastic for jesse and manu so each of them have four um so it's got four of these so that's secrets of the valley and red grape so four in total so she should be fine because we also have 24 bottles of water which are in the freezer right now and then for george myself and maybe my niece we got some um dried fours um, my sister is vegetarian, so and then Sunday is tomorrow. I'll be eating meat from after today's Easter vigil mass I can start eating meat again because my Lent feast is uh, my Lent Fast is over so I'm excited for all of the meat. My mom is also cooking ribs and chicken at the moment So like I'm like yay a little like a punnet of blueberries George is absolutely in love with blueberries, so I know he'll appreciate those. And then for the rest of us, I got some grapes. I feel like these were blasters, but like grapes are like something where you can find it even more old. Personally, and this one I'm not going to get my grapes if I said period. Just to finish off quickly, I got two things of trail mix. So there's the normal sunrise mix. Well, normal for me because this is the one I always get from food lovers. And then I told him I like sweet mixes, so he said to also try the Hawaiian trail mix. Also, um, my mom got us chocolate coated peanuts and chocolate coated whole nuts. And I got myself a little something special, though I know I'm going to end up eating it with my sister and my niece. Um, 
two of these because my anemia has been acting up especially today so i'm worried tomorrow and i don't want to take a double dose of iron meds because iron supplements will make you so constipated you don't even want to know um also got myself a big thing of aloe this is great if you're someone who suffers from migraines or hangover don't ask me don't ask me too many questions just if you get migraines or you like to drink one too many get acquainted okay so it's about 4 30 now and my aunt her husband and their children have just left um yeah so i literally didn't do any more packing from the time they came which is about 20 minutes after the last time i spoke to you guys and i'm about to show you guys what the room looks like jump scare okay i'm just telling you now it looks a disaster don't judge me it doesn't always look like this but obviously when you're packing it has to get messy to get clean again um so you know so what we have here is this is george's bag which is pretty much done this jacket i'm gonna fix properly but literally this is george's bag okay his clothes are folded i'm gonna add this jacket to it and these snacks don't need to be packed this is his outfit for tomorrow so he wants like this shirt and these brown pants that he loves to wear and then probably a pair of sandals so that's jesse's bag um all of his things are in there there are a few things missing that i'm hoping will still fit but we'll see that's gonna go in my mom's car they have their snack plastic bag and then this like duffel bag situation is mine what's at the top is a dress i recently had made by this seamstress from kumusha and i asked her to make me like a booboo -boo dress i just wanted to see what they would look like on me and i think i like it i might just get but oh one of the puppies got stepped on i think i don't know i'm now getting ready for church this vlog has been all over the place this is the dress i'm wearing it's very cute i got it from my husband's sister i think it's church friendly my mom says it's not too short what i need to do is just get like a pin and do this because I want to wear my sports bra today, I want to be comfortable and I don't want it to show. So this is a bit too much. The next thing on my never ending list of problems is I have a, a job that I applied for to be a content creator for a very big company that I'm interested in working with. And the applications are supposed to be in on the 31st of March, which is tomorrow. I've already filmed, I have the footage, everything, I just need to, and I've already compiled it, I just need to record the voiceover, add it to that, and then add some music and stuff, and that's what I haven't done. So my hope is that mass ends quite early today so that I can get home, finish cleaning, all of that, and then sit down, go on, do my voiceover, add my music, and then um, upload my video application. Tonight, I don't care if I'm going to do it at midnight, if I'm going to do it at 1am, like, our plan is to leave Harare at 4am, so it might just mean I'm really not sleeping today, but I don't mind, quite honestly. I don't know why you look so nice. Cry and that night, you rude. Want me to feel like I'm Hi, buddy. You're hungry, there are snacks in your power. Did you ask Goma Mama? Did you ask Goma Mama to get snacks in your car? My villa is not with you. I know you're not going to run. Tony, my villa is not with Evidence. I'm not going to run. I'm not going to run. I need to hold a corner. And there's no one. 
Don't get your looks so nice being a nice. 